Hello everyone, welcome back to the Grim Dawn Melee Pistols walkthrough. And we are back, and we are going to be coming in pretty hot. We are going to make ourselves some Spirit Bane ointments, and we are going to absolutely... We need a Rathstone first. There we go. Gonna absolutely have a blast here. We're going to absolutely get through the famous, the feared, the ancient grove. Theoretically. Uh, so let's pop on over and slap this out, yeah? Alright, so the main issue right now, now that we have actually decent chaos resistance here, we're at 80, uh, 78%, which is pretty strong. We're at, I think, normally, yeah, 27%, I was going to say 30% aether resistance, but it's decent enough, as long as we don't get to into some conflicts with some Aether enemies. That last death was... The death last time was because an Aether hero killed me, essentially, and I just wasn't paying enough attention to what I was standing on. Which is generally how that happened. Um, but, yeah, we're just gonna waltz on through. These guys, yeah, these guys are still worth my time. And, uh, we'll just see what we can do. We should be able to theoretically do it this time. So, we'll just go ahead and blast through there. That's right. And... Ta-da! Excellent. Okay. So. Ooh, hello. Fun little surprise. Oh, heroes! Alright, we're gonna put down an Inquisitor Seal here then. Okay, there goes your cronies, there goes you. And there goes your leftovers, I guess I'll call them. I don't know what else to call that. Alright, good. And we're almost there, hello. And yes. Take care of this little problem. Beautiful. Oop. Straggler. Not anymore. Oh, hello. And in we go. Now, something else I should also mention that I haven't really up till now, but a lot of the enemies in, uh, the Ancient Grove key dungeon portion of the deal here have a medium-ish resistance to fire. Now this isn't as much of a concern for me because I have the elemental resistance reduction of Aura of Censure, so this isn't as big of a deal for me as maybe it would normally, but they do have a medium- well it would be reduced to a small resistance to fire from there and a, a medium resistance, well, the small resistance to lightning as well for similar reasons, kind of. The Chthonics don't really have any kind of particular resistance to um, lightning, but the Ethereals have, generally speaking, a fairly average lightning resistance as opposed to the little to none a lot of other factions have, so it is something to keep an eye on here. But we'll, we'll, we'll overcome it. Hello, all these enemies here? What are we doing? I'm gonna use a really premature health potion here. Okay, we've gotten rid of the hero, which is awesome. Gotten rid of you. Also awesome. Alright, that worked out decently well. Hello. We don't need you here. Thank you. Can you skedaddle? Thank you. I appreciate that. Okay. Now then. Oh. We're surrounded. I am deeply concerned. As you can tell. Excellent, excellent. Congratulations, you've won. Get out of my face, thank you. And goodbye. You can get out of here. You can 
get out of here. And... Boom. Let's just slap you guys around. And there we go. Give my uh, energy a chance to rejuvenate naturally. Never mind. Oh, that was kind of trash. Oh, well. Hello. All right. Perfect. Oh, whoop, that tree is totally blocking my shots. That was a good throw. That was a nice throw. Excellent. There we go. Okay. Oh, this is kind of messy, but all right. Just kind of gotta get rid of all the crap over here. Good. Excellent. Decent throw. Decent throw. you and then we can focus on you and then get rid of these guys up here because holy cow there's a lot of plants what is this and I gotta get rid of you guys and take care of you guys fortunately the aura center will cover a lot of this there we go perfect holy cow though <laughs> okay. Oh, surprisingly, it didn't respond. Did you? You did. Goodbye. Come on over. Thanks. Take your chaos and go. I'm gonna win. I'm gonna win. Yeah, I still used a, I reflexively used a potion, but I really didn't need to. All right, now that we've won, we can go back, grab the key, and sell our crap. Also, we will allow our. Actually, we can just do it. The Coven's Refuge doesn't really make a huge difference. Coven's Refuge is a little bit faster, technically speaking. Because we just need to visit the. Storage Loon. Boom. And the Uptent Bogs need to go in here. And then we can sell. Oh no, we need to actually store our couple of artifacts really quick as well. I almost forgot about that. Or our single artifact, whatever. Same difference. So all of this stuff, because we've already looked at it, and it was found wanting. Uh... Nope, that's all. Oh, we need to actually pull out our skeleton key from our storage here. Uh, where the heck did that go? There it is. Not 100% sure why I've stored so many of these right now. I had them in there, not for any specific reason, they just kind of were in there. So, I don't know what I was thinking at the time, but here we are. All right, we're not going to activate the potion yet because we haven't actually gotten in there. Ah, it's so slow. If only it was slightly faster, we wouldn't all fall asleep waiting for it. All right, let's try this again. That's right. Hero right away, huh? All right. Pretty terrible uh, stun jack throws. We'll take care of you really quick first. There we go. Yeah, get ice snapped this way, huh? Get out of here. Problem solved. Don't do either damage, so we're gonna pass right over that. And hello. Lovely mess of ethereal damage. Gone. Out of 
here. Perfect. That was a bad demonic fire. Alright, there we go. There's a hero up there. Of course, he's ethereal. Come on over. There you go. Decent throw. Considering how small he is. There we go. Not worth it. At all. You can go away. Don't have time for him. My goodness. Alright. This again. Activate that really quick. Say stand in the portal, uh, the seal. There we go. We're doing just fine here. Excellent, yep. We need to get rid of this corner of his plant. There we go. I can barely see what's going on because of all these items lying on the floor. Very inconvenient. We have some ice going on here, which we do not need in our lives. There are too many of these crystal things running around. Go up here, then. Alright. Two, two ice lunatics. Okay, we're gonna back up over here. We're gonna back up over here. There we go. Okay. Can we stand here and do something about this? Kind of. The problem is, if I get too close, we're gonna have a problem, but we have to risk it anyways. We gotta go full out here. There we go. Get back in that seal. There we go. Okay. We did it. That was exciting. It was also fairly intense. That belt. Nope, that was not need. Scorpion? That's two handed ranged. Okay. Open my prize. Another empowered huntsman. Another shield. Excellent. Just what I always wanted. A simple delight. For that wide, that was not great, but it was serviceable. the uh, aether mess that we died at last time. We've got to be a little bit careful this time. There we go. There we go. That was a little bit better. That was a lot better, actually. Uh-huh. There's a corrupted somebody or other here. I can't tell which one. It must be this guy, because he's the last one standing. I'm standing in Aether. We do not want that at all. Okay, good. Come on. There we go. Whew, okay. All right. There's a boss around here somewhere that I want to kill. Actually, there's a couple of them. Okay, this does not look pleasant. There's a lot of void going on there that I'd rather not deal with. Good, good. Alright, we're cleaning up the streets. Good. Okay, good. Excellent. There's two other bosses here that I want to kill for their loot. One of them is fixed, one of them is pretty mobile, so we're going to need to keep an eye out for the mobile one. I'm going to look for the fixed one, though, first. Because theoretically speaking, they're easier to find for the obvious reason that they don't move much. 
Actually, they only stay in one localized area. It's just a matter of getting to that area. Uh... Oh, we have a problem here first. Hold on. Okay, there we go. Come on, there you go. Leave me alone for two seconds. I gotta buy some stuff. Alright. Buy that. We already have that. I think we... Okay. Alright. Let me see if you've got any good ones of these. Not really. Okay. Interesting. The Granada was fairly interesting, but we don't much care. We don't have Aether damage. That doesn't matter at all. Thank you. Yeah, all right. That's nice and all. But where is the guy that I'm looking for? Well, where are the two guys that I'm looking for? There we go. Whew. And... Not bad. I need that chaos resistance more than I need the elemental and bleeding resistance, obviously, though. Whoa. Alright. Somebody really slapped me really hard. What the heck was that? I didn't even get to see it. I just know it was excruciatingly disastrous for my health, and it almost killed me instantaneously. It was that bozo. Alright. Take you out really quick. Take you out really quick. Light spread so that we don't have to get so close. Get slapped. There we go. Holy cow, I'm telling you. Huh. Almost killed me instantaneously. I was going to say, if one of these three didn't come back, that would be very odd. Oh, is this where the... I think this is where the... Yep, it is. Okay. This is where the fixed one is. Whoop. You hit much harder than I thought because I don't have my Aether thing on anymore. Where, there we go. We've fixed the problem. Okay, you kind of slap. Okay. Bad throw. Okay. Not my best idea. It turned out okay, but definitely didn't go ideally. Come on, shoot your... No, you're not going to. Okay, there you go. You wait until I get in close enough. I see. Alright. You're standing in a desolation, Lion, so that's... Ah, man! I walked right into that. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. It's this Aether Resistance. Alright, so what we're gonna do... We are clearly not... in control of enough... Aether Resistance to make that work. So we're going to go ahead and continue on. We're not even going to bother with the Conflagration at this point, because clearly my Aether Resistance is too low for this, so we need to actually just go and do other things. Because I can already tell you that the Conflagration isn't going to work. That was my best shot right there. That was only 50% of that is Aether Damage, and the fact that I still couldn't get through that, I'm never going to get through the Conflagration, because it's 100% Aether Damage. So we're going to go back to the Steel Cap District for this. We're gonna do. We're gonna finish up by, I think, Malmoth here. Shouldn't really be too problematic. I mean, half of this is Aether and half of this is Elemental, which we're fine with the Elemental. Ideally, we'll find some equipment here that'll allow us to survive more Aether damage, because that is really just the only issue we're having right now. Like my damage output is fine. It's just the complete inability to handle Aether damage, even with a Spirit Bane ointment on, is is the problem here. It's just too low. Hello. Excuse me? Don't ignore me. Thank you. My goodness. Manners. You can be time warped all you want, but you have terrible manners. Alright. <laughs> just instantly wipe those guys out. There we go. Okay. So we still need to find the weapon supplies, which is fine. We need to find the groups of survivors who 
I kind of remember where they are off the top of my head. Kind of. I don't want to look at the devotion shrines. It doesn't matter, though. Come on, there you go. Come on, there you go. I'm not even intended for long range engagements, and I'm wiping these guys out. What the heck is this? There we go. Get out of my face. I'm trying to get through here. There we go. While you're lying on the floor, why don't you just drop that for me? There you go. Excellent. Thank you. Oh, hold on. You're still alive back here. Never mind. Oh, get out of here. My goodness. Now, I'm pretty sure I opened this up. I did not. Okay, fair enough. Come on, I'm trying to get through here. Pardon me. Get out of the way. Thank you. That's right. Taking you down, fleshy boy. Whew. All right. So, we'll probably go around this way. Should be fine. Oh, a hero. All right. Poison, huh? Fair enough. Take out the cronies first. Activate Inquisitor's Seal. Get rid of you. There we go. Thanks for the useless greatsword. Love it. Another one of these, huh? Alright. Blast our way through as usual. All these reinforcements coming to try to save you. You're beyond saving. I'm sorry. This is the truth. These are the facts I'm spitting here. You're doomed. You are absolutely doomed. I will slap you to next week. Thank you, and good night. I don't know what he was thinking, but alright. <laughs> you can try. Got some energy there. Perfect. Oh. <sighs> You will notice that I'm doing much better against these enemies. These enemies are actually roughly my approximate appropriate level. The enemies in the Ancient Grove were actually slightly higher. Alright, yep. Just trying to slap my way through here. Come on, there you go. Here we go. Goodbye. You're out of here. Goodbye. You're... Well, gotta go. That was a terrible throw. I didn't realize this wagon was blocking me that much. Doesn't matter, though. What did we drop back here? Useless stuff. Cool. Excellent. Par for the course. Par for the course. No brand new car for me. <laughs> and... Get rid of you you out. Oh, there we go. Wander on down here. Get out of here. Just wipe this out really quick. Goodbye. And that's the direction we want to go in, so we're going to go... Oh, right. This is just excessive. Now, as low of a level as Inquisitor Seal is, you can already see it paying off to some extent. Wait till it gets to max level, and then you're really going to see some fireworks. Then we have, we'll have Word of Renewal on top of that, and that'll just be absolutely disgusting. You're not even going to get the opportunity. Alright, get out of here. Oh, right. Yeah, there's one of the groupies. That's the weapons cache, excuse me. <laughs> the 
This is wild. Oh. Oh. Too much of that stupid aether swirls flying around. Alrighty. Back we go. At least most of the enemies have already been cleared out ahead of time, so we just have to make a run for it. Although it's still a decently long run. I should have put down a rift, honestly. This is my fault, though. What do you... My goodness. Can't you people behave? For two seconds? My goodness. So, essentially, we still haven't found anything new to equip that will increase our Aether Resistance, which is unfortunate, but that's how it goes sometimes. We'll be fine, though. We'll be fine. We really need to open this up here, down here. That was a weird sentence. Open this up down here, right here, 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 and here, and then over there because I want to go here, faster than here. Here, 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 here. <laughs> My goodness. Oh, hello. Um, how you doing? What are you doing? Why are you here? Why are you here? We can do a widespread there. And, like, problem solved. Pretty quick there. Not even an issue. The heck? What even? My goodness. Oh, I never did take out this Aether Crystal. There we go. Put down a Rift right here. I'll probably put another one down a little bit later on, but I've already been ambushed twice now, so... Let's not take any more um, unnecessary risks here. Actually, I still have... No, I don't. Because I can't survive against Aether to save my life. There we go. That should be fine. Okay, this is too much. Really? Can we just relax for two seconds, guy? I'd throw to get rid of all of his cronies. Or most of them, anyways. Okay. Another wide throw that was terrible. Just way too much aether here. That was a good throw right up directly on him, but we're still taking too much aether damage here. That's a terrible throw. We're about to die. There we go. No, can we not? Thank you. Come on. There we go. Holy cow. Alright. Oh, I'm standing in Aether still. My goodness, it's everywhere. Holy cow. <sighs> My goodness. Alright, finally that little problem is solved. Get these guys out of here. More Aether Swirlies, but there's only one or two, I think. Just stand in the middle of it, and we're fine. Hello. This is an unpleasant surprise. But that's fine. We can survive, adapt, and overcome all at the same time. We're gonna go open up that dynamite place. There we go. You can just stop yourself. This is not, this is not the way to the, whoops, <laughs> brain fart. Oop, let me get, just get stuck real quick, don't worry about it. 
<laughs> My goodness. Here we go. Well, you're not doing anything on the ground. Why don't you just drop that for me? Thank you. Oh, you, you're down. There we go. Oh, free real estate. Excellent. Goodbye. Get out of here. There we go. What are you doing? I think you can dodge my stun jack so easily. Get out of here. Nobody got time for that. Hero, huh? Not anymore. There's way too much criti uh, critical. Aether damage going on here. Critical damage. That too. There we go. Alright. Perfect. Oh, Aether damage, I'm telling you. We're actually going to go back because we want to go this side because I'm pretty sure that's where one of the people is hiding. Hmm. They just get stuck real quick. It's fine. Oop. There we go. Random straggler. All right. Oh, wait. He's got friends. He's got a lot of friends, actually. Anyone else want to show up to this party? There we go. Thank you. My goodness. This is not... Why do I... Why can I never remember this map, honestly? I mean, the, the dynamite is nice and all, but still. That was an entirely unnecessary trip, because I couldn't remember that that was a dead end. Nice job, me. <laughs> Good job. All right. There's that. Harbor down there. And we'll just wander over this way, because I can't remember where the people are. Again. <laughs> oh, hello. That's what I thought. Problem solved. And we just go up here, I think. Lots of criminal records were stored in this building for some unknown reason. Actually, it's just, it's a whole thing in library. It is an actual library. Oh, okay. Oh, this is the library. This is where everything, okay. Yeah, 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 I remember. I, forgot, I totally forget about this because they don't always come here. This is basically where you come to get all the books, that, the randomized book drops that maybe you didn't get earlier. Interesting. Still don't do either damage though, so. Blast all of you to pieces. There we go. There we go. Don't need this location. Not at this time, anyways. Don't need that either. Alright. Oh, I can never remember this this map. I don't know why, but I never can remember where the people are hidden. I don't understand why. It's I just always draw a complete blank on this area. I have that problem to some smaller extent with Forgotten Gods, but not as much. 
I just have a really hard time remembering Malmuth very specifically. That's not bad, but I need the other resistance more. some of them right there. I think that was one of the groups. Oh, I'm rescuing them early. That's why they haven't shown up on the map, silly me. Let's make a huge difference, though. probably should go on ahead and rift back so I can report in the supplies and actually get the stars to find these people because I have a hard enough time remembering where they are without it. Yeah, okay. Then we'll go back because now I've at least got the quest I need to actually find them easier. Boy, do I have a heck of a time remembering where they are without it. There we go. Oh, I had a bit of a... Too much visuals going on there. There we go. Oh, no, pardon me. There we go. Aren't they up here, I think? We survived a little longer than I was expecting, honestly. There we go. Okay, so I kind of remember these people. you because you're just kind of chilling out here for no reason. Alright. Alright. Go ahead and report that in, because there's still the, uh, the Fleshworks, I think, right? That's right, the harbor. And then I think you... No, that's apparently at a specific uh, rep point. But we gotta do the bomb anyways. see. I think we just charge up the middle here and that's about it. We uh, trigger the bomb. Yeah, that's... I think that's how we're going to run this down. Yep, here it is. Alright. And I'm just gonna run up on you and get all up in your business.
Okay, and then I think... No, we haven't actually gotten a rep bonus with the, um... Mammoth Resistance yet. But I can double check. I want to get the, uh... Quest to do the... V yes, here it is, okay. Alright, that's fine. Go ahead and do the vents really quick, and then that'll probably be it for the episode. Alright. Just take care of that problem. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is quite messy. Nothing we can't handle. Oh, we've already taken this out. Alright. Never mind about Johnny. Didn't want to do that right then, but alright. Thanks anyways. No, oh, come on. There you go. Now, for the vents, it's actually a little easier to just cut across and go to the other side, and then just kind of go up to the middle. So we're actually going to go head back and then go up this way, and that's actually quite a bit easier than looping around the whole way, which a lot of people tend to do. I usually do it as well, but I'm going to think actually strategically this time, very specifically. Totem up here, nice. Guy just came out of the ground and just immediately dies. A dweeb in the corner. That, ah, my, my stun jacks got stuck in the air. All right, sure. We'll go with that. Seems legit. Oh, you're still alive. Hold up. Oh, you're a hero. Whoops. And there goes my Sunjax getting stuck in the air again. There we go. It turned out okay, I guess. Just go ahead and take care of this little problem right here. There we go. Then we have the totem we can do really quick. These lunatics we can deal with really quick. Medium spread throw. That was actually pretty good, though. It landed around them quite nicely. Encompassed the area very decently, indeed. Alright, there we go. Come on. There we go. Nice. Okay, do we get anything useful here? Fire and lightning, vitality resistance, elemental resistance. We don't need the vitality and elemental resistance, and although the fire and lightning damage is nice, and the explosive damage is nice, we still don't ultimately need it. We need the poison acid resistance, we need the bleeding resistance, we need the pierce resistance, more. Just elemental again. My goodness. Poison acid and bleeding we need. Nah, we didn't get anything we needed here. Interesting. Huh. Now, the main problem with this, and the reason why it doesn't enhance damage as much, even if we were to go ahead and attach the same kind of enhancements to this, is that it increases cold damage, which we are straight up not doing. So that's a bit unfortunate. Pretty soon, though, once we hit level 62, we'll be able to actually forge and equip better pistols. Of be well, better versions of the pistols we've already got on. So, we'll have that to look forward to. Unless we find better pistols by then, anyways. 
which is possible. But only time will tell. Oh. Hello. Oh, you're a hero and I'm being shelled by 1,200 people. That's fine. Yeah, that Aether Storm is absolutely going to kill me. There we go. Well, the Aether Storm is gone at the very least. For now. You're stuck. You are straight stuck. Alright, I guess I'll just kill you before you unstuck. Alright, cool. What did I just pick up? Uselessness. Okay, fantastic. Okay, there we go. And then we're just going to loop around the corner here and do the middle vent here. Okay. Nope, denied. Whew. Pretty close. We're about to get another level up. Which is mixed news. I need to deal with you, lunatics, but... Oh, holy cow. I've been caught in a poopy trap. I'm respected by the Malmuth Resistance, which is nice and all. Check their wares really quick. Holy cow, that was very intense. Alright. solved mostly all right so we're gonna go back and we're gonna see what the mammoth resistance um merchant has to offer and uh we'll go ahead and end the episode here i don't want to go into there right away because there is the potential issue of oh wait we'll go ahead and do that really quick first Where is the... Did I just buy something I didn't want to? Probably. By accident. We'll go ahead and sell our stuff really quick, though. Go ahead and sell all this junk. Oh, we sold all the junk already. Alright. You have... These, of course. And these all require me to be level 65, but is there anything I'll actually need at that point? Or of censure canister bomb? That's fairly interesting. Or of censure, of course, we do want. Canister bomb we could incorporate in. It gives us chaos and bleeding resistance. That's fine. What is our bleeding resistance at currently? It's way over max, so that would actually be okay. Beyond that, what else do we have here, huh? Uh, let me see. Nothing really leaps out and says, hey, I'm actually good for your build. Just that one helmet. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. Alright. So. I believe she's talking about, uh. This area here. Which we can get to pretty quick by just running through and. Just going through the dynamite section. That should be pretty quick. We 
we shouldn't really have any problems there. Oh, hello, random chest. Hey, ladies and gentlemen. Go ahead and do this really quick first. Now, the reason why I don't want to go into the flesh works quite yet is because clearly Aether Resistance is still a problem. I have not done anything with this. I have not yet been able to do anything with this. I might check some of the other factions if I've gotten any reputation boosts, which I may or may not have. It really depends. To see if I can get anything that I can slap on my armor to increase my Aether Resistance, which I desperately need. Yeah, this is the place. Oh. This is going to get excruciatingly messy very quickly, I think. Just based on this. Oh, it's, let's immediately die. Cool. <laughs> I should have put down a stupid rift. But it wasn't that much of a long trip because of the um, shortcut there, so... My goodness, I keep forgetting to put down rifts. Egat! <laughs> Actually, would it be faster to just go from... No, that wouldn't be faster. This is still going to be faster. So we need to find a solution for the Aether Resistance, because clearly, I don't have it. Now, a lot of you are thinking, well, you could go for the shrines, but yeah, I'm already in enough experience trouble, I'm already too high of a level enough as it is, I don't want to really slap that way higher than I needed to. You'll see what I'm talking about in Elite, midway through Elite, most likely, uh, where that's really going to become a problem, but I don't want to do that for, first off, it's not going to give me as much experience as they will in Ultimate, which is when I'll really need the resistances. Right now, it's just a single individual resistance problem. Uh, and that's just basically been because of unfortunate luck in my equipment drops. I just haven't gotten anything that's given me really good quality Aether Resistance. That's It's just dumb luck, really. It's not even necessarily a problem with the build or a problem with how I've been playing. It's it just it comes down to I just haven't gotten a piece of equipment with good enough Aether Resistance that's been worth equipping. It didn't sacrifice more than one other resistance at minimum, really, is what it comes down to. That's, that's the main issue here. It's just been bad luck. And me being at the point in the game where I really, really want Aether Resistance and just not having the luck to have that available to me at this point in time. Something else that not a lot of other people talk about as well is when you have Aura of Censure and Ulswin's Wrath, when you knock someone over with Ulswin's Wrath, they're just basically laying on the floor taking fire damage and not doing anything about it, which is pretty amazing. Another excellent use with uh, Aura of Censure would be Alexa's Flash Freeze. Which not only increases the amount of... Well, not only does it decrease the enemy's fire resistance, which is pretty awesome, but they also are just sitting there frozen, taking all this fire damage. So it works out really well as a combo. I mean, that's not the only way the Inquisitor works really well with the Arcanist, but it's one of my favorite ways. Black Iron Docks are overrun. No kidding, that's why we're here. My goodness. He's on my side. Is he? Yeah, Mammoth Resistance. Okay. Just this random guy throwing out some ice shots there. Alright. I saw the sniper guy in, on the dock die. Oh, hello. We don't need you here. There. I'm gonna walk away from the, uh... Ether fest there. Thank you. Come on. There we go. OK, 
Okay. Use it, thank you. Oh, that poison damage, we're gonna get out of that. My poison resistance is decent enough, but I still don't want to be standing in it. There we go. Come on. Nope. Standing in something. Okay. Ah, uh, but I put down a rift this time. It's up there smack dab in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> I was standing in something. I couldn't see what it was because there's so many enemies around, but I was standing in something. Either that or the guy with the fire ring around him was the problem there. This should be pretty interesting. Will they jump on me before I actually spawn? No, fortunately. This guy. I think he was the main problem here. Very good. Get rid of those tentacles. There we go. Alright. I think we got this. Yeah. Alright. Anyone else we need to worry about? Anything else we need to worry about? No? Alright. Holy cow. Almost made it through all that. Almost. Okay, so... We're not going to get to here, obviously, but... Let's see... Now, last episode, we checked with Homestead and the Kimmins Chosen, who are now respected with the Nalmoth Resistance, respected by the Rovers, respected by the Black Legion. The Outcast doesn't have anything particular that we need. Actually, we should double-check that. I can't remember off the top of my head, but we'll go ahead and double-check that really quick. She might have a piece of torso armor or something that we could really use. Maybe. I can't quite remember. Potentially something useful, but we'll check. What it comes right down to is I just need more Aether Resistance. There's just not a whole lot of stuff that I can equip to provide that. Yeah. Not really anything I need. The Rune Armor Vignifar is still going to be better. All right, so, hmm. Well, we'll see what we can do next episode in the Fleshworks, then. I will probably stop and try to kill Bane Gargoth uh, next, actually, because we do have uh, pretty good vitality and excellent chaos resistance, so that's just going to be getting rid of the guy in the, uh, that is in the Void Rift in the Plains of Strife. We can just take care of that really quick, just wipe that out, and uh, go ahead and deal with that. That'll give us potentially some opportunities to get some better items, or it'll just be a really quick breeze through. It depends on what their level is. I can't remember off the top of my head. But with that being said, we had some success today. The, the failure in the Ancient Grove, of course, still continued problems with the Aether Resistance, but we were able to, despite that low Aether Resistance, get through most of the rest of Malmoth pretty nicely. The Fleshworks is the only place that remains. Uh, so we'll see what we can do with that. And, uh, in the meantime, thank you all very much for watching me and joining me on this adventure. And thank you very much for joining me on this adventure. I do appreciate it. And if you if you have any comments, questions, concerns, ideas, suggestions, what have you, please leave them down in the comment section below. I do read them. And uh, if you like this, please like and subscribe and have a great 24 hours.